Hello and welcome, my name is Parky and this is Parky's Shorts, a series which will allow me to play a variety of games on my channel recommended by you. If you want or two episodes, play a new game and if it gets a brilliant response from you guys and maybe play this full series on my channel. Could I say that much quicker? I don't think so. <laughs> Today we're going to be playing Pixel Heroes Bite and Magic. I saw this on Steam, it looked pretty interesting and it looked like it had some good humour in it as well, which is always nice in these sort of games. So this is what we're going to go for, so choose a campaign for your adventure. Fools of Radiance, or Radiance if you're not an idiot and can speak English properly. <laughs> Welcome to the tavern. Some brave heroes have found their way to these far reaches, seeking treasures and glory. I love the music, it's completely inappropriate. Hire three heroes for your epic adventure. I'm the one man wolf pack. <laughs> Is that a reference to, um, what's it, Hangover Part 1 or something? I have no idea. Bartender want more beer. Brown's my favourite colour. Wow, that is a lovely fact. So I reckon we'd probably go with... Me and my wolf, sure. Halfling Wolf Rider. He ate a lot of carrots as a child. So he's got Dexterity Plus. Okay, of course, because that makes complete sense. Fangs, charge... Eh. Not sure if I like the look of that guy, actually. Let's have a look at this guy. Dwarf Fighter. Hang on, is he the same height as everyone else? Oh no, he is actually a dwarf, that's good. At least I've got the continuity there. <laughs> Very important thing. Shield bash and bollock. Range self? Yeah. Of course we've got the uh, war mage, which is an epic sounding thing. Of course I have to go for a more war mage. I have to. And what are you? You're a ronin. What is a ronin? Is that like a... a rogue? I guess. We need like a tanky person. A human healer, basically. Uh, what are you? You are an enchantress. I guess really we should go for a dwarf fighter as well. And one more. Let's go for... Possibly... Enchantress? Protection and dispel? Protection from everything? That could be useful, though I suppose... Maybe a ronin would be good. Blade Dance. So we've got a, a mage, a, a fighter, and what else? We probably could do with a healer or some kind of enchantress. Adventurer. He always ate his vegetables. Last week he learned how to juggle. <laughs> He's got a restraining order <laughs> because of his hot beer. He is deathly afraid of enormous cows. He has nightmares dancing naked at a dirty river every night. The Cute Snail is his favourite book. I'm sorry, what are the descriptions of these guys? <laughs> that is amazing. At the age of 12, he becomes the youngest publisher of philosopher in P Pixton. Intelligence. He does some push-ups in the morning, plus strength. Of course. Wow, this is amazing. Let's go with... I'm feeling... I'm feeling the Enchantress. I don't really know why. She never missed a day of church growing up. Faith, plus one. Yesterday she invented integral calculus, but forgot how to take notes. Intelligence, plus one. She famously defeated a spicy banana in a duel. Oh, you spicy banana. And she is sexually attracted to green axes, of course. She once fell in love with a nice stone. She believes aliens abducted her friendly pig. Why not? Let's go. For golden glory, bold and mighten. Yes, good choice. <laughs> Very... Okay, well, whatever. Is this the end? Of course, because there is a man coming towards us with an end sign. They called themselves Sons of Dawn and prayed to some dark elder being. They've started recruiting people for their cause all over the country. I fear something, because I clicked like an idiot. Spend your last days wisely. We will meet again once the time has come for your final quest. Lovely. The stars are so bright. What are we doing here? Spread wings, temple, shroom. Oh, so I have to click on them before we walk past the sea. Fresh and juicy, the old volcano. Do you think you can help me out? I recently heard of a very rare and tasty mushroom called Fungus Bossus Yummy Yummy, which I'd like to use as an ingredient. Problem is, it only grows on big bad monsters, and you might have noticed I'm not much of a fighter. Would you mind getting some of that Fungus Bossus Yummy Yummy for me? Sure. <laughs> yes, perfect! My next meal is going to be spectacular, thanks to you. I wish you the best. Okay, quest, the old volcano. How do I do this? Can we even do it? Go. You sure want to leave this town? The destination is the old volcano. 
Let's go. Let's do it. We're probably going to die horribly, but we are epic adventurers. There's a group of people with instruments standing on the side of the road. Greetings! We are travelling musicians and we call ourselves laymen. Would you be so kind and lend us an ear, or preferably two? Listen. Marvellous! See, we just come back from an ancient temple of El Elgoog, where the famous artifact, the Tubes of You, is on display. Artists from all over the country go there to protect their music and art into the tubes. All to the ceremony is complete. <laughs> Every beholding tubes can see the exact projection of what the artist imagined. You should definitely go there. Oh, what's this? Achievement unlocked. Tubes of You. Listen to Lehman to the travelling musicians. New hero unlocked. Bard. Lovely. Uh, no, let's, let's continue travelling. Fuck rest. We don't need it. So that was a chief. Wow, we're doing so well. Sort of. Carrot. You see a carrot sticking out of the ground. Looks like he's wig wriggling a little bit. Hey, you! Yeah, you! I'm talking to you! I like how they have the same voice as the bloody travelling band back there. She, I got accursed and now I've now spent my life as a talking carrot. Not fun. The only way to live this curse is to eat me, so please, by the great ambassador. Eat me. <laughs> Perfect reading. This is either going to kill me or it's going to be amazing. This seems like a trick because to free him would be to kill him. Logically, this doesn't make sense. I'm going to decline your offer, sir. Sir Carrot, a lot. The heroes refuse to eat the carrot. Oh no, as I have to spend my life as a vegetable. Why won't someone put me out of my misery and drop something on the table whilst I'm recording? Do you want to take rest? Let's, let's continue travel. I just don't feel like that was probably a wise thing to do. Hello, science man. The nerd. You see an angry looking guy. He's wearing a white shirt with a pocket pouch full of pens. Oh no, that wasn't actually the nerd speaking. That was just me being a weirdo, apparently. Great! Now I'm inside a shitty game. Look at all the graphics. I don't even have a mouth. I'm sorry? You do actually have a mouth. I can see you opening it, sir. I'm not supposed to look angry. What a fucking piece of fucking bullfuck. <laughs> okay. And the music something. Look how slow you move. I'm just waiting to arrive at the damn dungeon. Come on, move your ass. What are they thinking? Why is the inventory space so small? Like I can't carry more shit around. Are you shitting me? Whatever program this is an arsehole. And no continues? Like seriously, give me a reason why there's no fucking continues. I've got to calm down, okay? For now, so run. See how smart you are. Do you know which game I'm p punishing here? Which game? Um... I probably should have listened to that, shouldn't I? Is it... T.E. the extra t external? No way in hell I'm talking about that. Yeah, I've earned XP for that, of course. What? <laughs> I'm sorry, what? <laughs> Our dwarf looks just as conf confused as I do. What the fuck? Oh my god, what is this screen? Okay, so we've got our gear, our stats as well, and other stuff. Go. Dungeon, the old volcano. Enter room. We are being attacked. Good observation. So... Okay, we're not going to get any form of tutorial. I suppose you don't probably need one. Mediocre spell of acid rain inflicts all. There we go. Is that good? He's soft. Oh, I killed one of them. Killed two of them. Killed all of them. Holy shit. Demon unlocked. First blood. Defeat your first enemy. This game is amazing. What is this? Oh, are these things that I got? I see, okay. Healing potions. Lovely. <laughs> What's this thing? So we've got an amulet as well. Nurturing necklace, or necklet of compression. Life plus four, strength plus four, dexterity minus four. Immunity to fire. Holy shit, that's really good. Let's give this to our dwarf. Let's go. Room two. They're good as dead! Thank you. Thank you for that input. Well, this was really good last time, so I'm going to do this on all of them again. He's using Flame Strike. 
Okay, so what have we got here? Fist, Sword of Boredom, <laughs> Axe of Boredom, Shield of Boredom. Well, let's get rid of this guy. Is that going to kill him? Yeah, it is. Lovely. Oh, they're walking towards me. This is not good. They're focusing down her, which is a bit worrying. And she's now got fire damage. Well, let's swing our sword at him. Imp artillery. Because that's apparently a thing. Is this like an imp juggler or something? Are they going to attack Banu again? Oh no, they're attacking the other two. That's lovely. I hope these uh, status effects don't carry on to the next round. That would be rather irritating indeed. Do we get healed after the round? This is the ultimate question in this game. Dinky Arcus of Mindbreak. Disingrating armament of ten tedium. <laughs> Healing potions. Healing potions are good. I would assume, considering how many healing potions we got, we don't heal. Okay. Small healing potion. There we go. So that's apparently how we heal up there. So what is this? Vital pouch of wisdom? Life, intelligence, and faith. So we probably want to give this to her, don't we? Life and faith. Boom. Life. We'll give that to our mage, shall we? Put this on here. Actually, what is this? Mediocre ring of mediocrity. Probably not worth wearing. So what is this? Plus two shield and plus nothing else. So I guess we can give this to him. Actually, no, that's probably not a wise thing to do. What are you wearing, my dear? So this is rubbish. Can we get rid of it? Bin. There we go. Uh, we don't actually have an archer, which is fine. Pouch of wisdom. Might be worth giving this to him instead, actually. Sure. Okay, let's go into the next room. That'll do. That'll do, donkey. That'll do. Prepare for battle. Okay, well, I think we're just going to acid everyone, because that seems like a good thing to do. Ineffective. Oh my god. Well, let's now do a big sword hit on this guy. I'm just going to try and take down all the daggers. Oh no, we can't. We actually got to go for this guy at the front. Interesting indeed. Do we get any stats of how much health we've got? I'm guessing not. I'm clicking on him, he's not doing anything. Well, he's dead now, so it doesn't really matter. See, have you got to kill them in order? Is that the idea? Damn you! Okay, well, let's go for another acid rain. Acid rain! Please don't ever sing again. You'll feel my pain. I did a little rap, did you get it? I've done a lot of rapping in my videos recently. What's wrong with me? Look how happy they are. That was a Ez Pez room. Ez Pez indeed. Now, what is this? Range 1 to 3, 18 magical. Radiant enchantment of Thunderbolt. Oh, okay, I see. So these are these skills that I can exchange? No? Shield bash? Magic sword. Hmm. Oh, we can dual wield. So we can have a bow as well as that. That's interesting. So, what is this? Mediocre spell of blood dagger. Range 1 to 3, 32 magical. Inflicts 50%. Range 1 to 3, 38 magical. 13 plus 80. Sure. Let's do that, shall we? And I don't think we need to heal anyone. Probably get rid of this ring. Although, should I actually be getting rid of these things? I should probably be saving them so I can sell them in a shop. I have no idea. Die! You will die! Alright, calm down. Calm down. We should name them. What's her name? Oh, they've actually already got names. <laughs> of course. Cutty, Eridanus, and Benu. Right, Benu, do your stuff. Top class bitch, Benu. Okay, well, let's now go for a ranged attack on this guy. I don't know why, I just want to... Oh, it's really ineffective. Lovely. And he can heal! Even more lovely. Let's focus him down. Ineffective? What is effective against them? Ow. Alright, let's get rid of this one. Fuck this. Get rid of the less difficult enemies first. Less to hit you overall, then you can focus on the boss. I guess this is a kind of a boss. God, yeah, that is really horrible. 
die, please? My god, he's still not dead. What is going on? Bainu, Bainu, come on, my dear. We're going to die horribly. Maybe we should... Magic missile? Magic sword? Uh, if you're stuck in battle, select knight and push this button. Uh, can I go into... Can I not use health potions? Wow, okay. So we can't actually use health potions whilst in battle, which is kind of rubbish. Go, power! Shut up. There we go. That'll do it. Damn, that room was horrible. What happens if we die? Shameful tome of redemption? Dashing hat of adequacy? Of course, flesh rendering baton of power. Disingrating hallberg of tedium? Healing potions. Thank God for the healing potions. Heroes have now reached the next level. You can add points to the attributes. Or attributes, even. Right, so we can probably... What should we put this in? I guess strength would be a good one. Life as well. Put one in life and one in strength. There we go. And we'll put in this one. One into... Intelligence. And one into life. I think we need life, quite desperately. This one, I guess we can kind of put into life as well, and possibly faith? What is faith even used for? I don't really know. I'm going to put one in faith. It'd help if I actually knew what these were doing, wouldn't it? Okay, well, let's use one of these on him. One of these on him. Okay, so we've got a hat here. I guess we can give this to the mage guy. There we go. Lovely. Lovely jubbly indeed. I feel as though the mage should probably be using some sort of one of these. So let's give a mage one of those. Give him like a battle mage sort of set up with a sword and a... Well, he is actually a battle mage, so that's not a completely strange idea. And what else have we got here? We've got one of these, a Hallberg of Tedium, which is rubbish, I believe. Yep, okay, we can get rid of that. This is probably okay. We've got this healing... Wow, this is actually really bad, this book. So maybe we can replace this with... Although it is... Does it affect all of them? I think it does actually... No, it, it's not that bad because it does affect all of them. Okay, well, I guess we can probably leave it like that. I feel like we might as well heal her up again. Sure. Okay, well, this seems like a good place to end it. If you enjoyed the episode, please feel free to your supporting comment section below. And leave ratings. Tell me whether you want to see more of this series, this game in the series, even. And maybe check out my Patreon. Link is in the description below. There's lots of cool prizes on there if you support me. Thank you for watching. Goodbye, awkward, awkward goodbye. Awkward.